<laughs> there we go. Hey. There he is. I tried to actually make a uh, hardcore guy earlier today because I was like, okay, I got the perfect name. I was like, I'm going to make a Torin Druid. I got the perfect name. And it said, name unavailable. And I turned the game off because I was sad. I was like, I, I, it was so, it was perfect. Yo, what up, Carol? What's going on? Let's do it. How's it going? I'm chilling. All right. All right. But yeah, what's going on? Me and my brother, we just got done... A little while ago, we get, just got done playing uh, Halo 4. I am forsaken. Embrace the We've been playing all the Halo games, right? So we did two, we did three. And today we beat four in one sitting. We kind of speed ran it. I haven't got all day. I haven't got all day. Um, so we beat... Can I, should I sell these? That's like a lot. Do I ever even use bandages? I don't even need bandages. Well, okay, well hold on. Do you, can you use bandages in combat? I have like cannibal corpse, right? So I can just eat whatever the crap I want. Anyway. <laughs> Stop laughing. <laughs> okay, I can't remember either. If you can use them in combat, I feel like that's kind of helpful. Uh, so we finished Halo 4, and I started loading Halo Infinite. Because I, my brother just got it for me on sale uh Steam. Because apparently they finally added like, the co-op campaign, which we've been waiting for forever. So uh, I started loading that, and said it was going to take three hours. So uh, he's like, I'm going to go do some other stuff. Um... Bye. And I was like, alright, I'm gonna stream because uh it's pretty late, as you can tell, but I'm not uh, I'm, I'm not tired, so I wanted to play a little bit. I was gonna do a different game, honestly. I was thinking of Zelda, but I was like, you know what, it's so stinking late, everyone is gonna be asleep, other than Carol. <laughs> I was like, I need help with Zelda. So I'm just gonna do WoW because it's nice and chill, relaxing. You can just hang out, explore. And I won't need help from too many people. Running low mythics tonight. Ooh, sounds fun. Like I said, mythic one to uh, mythic one to like nine, I think, is really fun. It's like not too uh, not too stressful. It's fun little fun little challenge. When you get past ten, that's where it's like okay, sweat mode activated. Okay, so I know we have a quest to uh, go. Why aren't my... Hold on. Why aren't my hot bars showing? Do you see that? Action bars always show. You see that? That's a glitch. Blizzard, get on that. I think the highest we did was 10. Alright, that's good. That's a good. That's a good one. Uh, I know we have a quest to go kill... Uh, where is it? Here we go. Go, uh, go kill Murlocs. That's to go to Undercity. Hold on. Uh, I wish I could zoom the map in. Look, it's a gnome! Uh, yeah, we'll just start running north. I need to read the quest because we have like a ton. And I don't... Last time, uh, last night I picked them all up. I didn't know what any of them were. So let's see. Uh, Scarlet, Scarlet Insignias. Venture forth and kill them. Yeah, they're just like all over the place. Chill of Death. Dusk bat pelts and coarse thread. Well, I know we can buy coarse thread. My hand, my hands shake from the chill. Five dusk bat. Those are just like everywhere, right? Just bats. Mills overrun. The scourge mills must. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Uh, they're trying to form a base at the Akamon Mills. Go to the mills, collect notch ribs, and uh, to get to the mills, follow the road west. After crossing the bridge, take the next. Fork north, then keep going north. When you see the windmills, the battle begins. Oh crap! Ah! 
I shouldn't. <laughs> That's why you don't like text and drive. I'm cursed. I'm playing for two minutes and I'm cursed. Garen's Haunt. Solid. Oh, that's that's over here, isn't it? Those mills, that's where they want us to get? I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. But, uh, yeah. How you doing, Carol? How you feeling? Feeling any better? Feeling any worse? You son of a gun. I was actually, uh... That okay, never mind. <laughs> I thought there was somebody sneaking up on me. Oh, look, someone, <laughs> someone, someone's uh, invited me to their. Is that a guild? First of the month? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> is that a guild? Hold on, I need to give. I need to kill bats. Hold on. First of the month. Guild. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll join a guild if it's got a funny name or a cool name. I barely ate today. Oof. You gotta get some food in, my friend. Even if you're feeling like crap. You gotta eat. But, uh, yeah. I thought, I thought this would be kind of fun. Kind of relaxing to do some while. So hopefully you guys don't fall asleep too quickly. Or, maybe this will be good uh, ASMR uh, World of Warcraft to fall asleep to, and, and you'll be passed out before you know it. I'm trying to think, what did I... I, I had a turkey sub, I had a turkey sub and some M&Ms. I mean, the turkey's good, but you need more than M&Ms, my friend. You gotta get some three musketeers in there. Aren't I? Uh, do I? Sp dusk bat pelt. Yeah, I should be killing dusk bats. I need to get closer. ASMR <laughs> shank playing well. I hate my own voice, so I can't imagine trying to make an ASMR video where I have to like edit it and listen to myself in great detail. God, it's a nightmare. Hey, there we go. There's a pelt. Cool. Gonna get some dominoes tomorrow. Like the pizza, or like you're actually gonna get a thing of dominoes to play the game? <laughs> I hate my voice too. Isn't it? Okay. Like, I know, I know it's a thing. I know there's a scientific thing behind it. But... What is it where, like, the way you hear yourself and the way you perceive yourself, and then when you hear yourself on a recording, it's just completely different? Like, why is that? What is that? Because, you know, in my head, well, the way I think, my inner monologue is a voice. And when I'm talking right now, it sounds a certain way in my head. I sound a certain way. And when I listen to recordings or VODs or whatever, I turn into like stinking Seth Rogen and I'm like, oh my gosh, I actually sound like that. I'm like, I'm, I'm playing, I'm playing like World of Warcraft tonight. I just like sound completely different. I'm like, oh my lord, I hate it. Growing up, I used to get complimented on my voice, but that stopped when I grew up. Oof. <laughs> I've had people, I think I've had a few people come in and say, oh, your voice is so silky smooth and relaxing or whatever, but I'm like, no. Nah. My mom, however, you should hear her. She gets, because she's got an accent. She has, a, everybody comes up to her and goes, oh my gosh, like, just, just talk for me. I would like pay you to read a book and listen. I would listen to uh, your audio book. What are we doing? So we need to kill Vile Fin Scale. Is that just kill Murlocs and we get a chance of getting that? 
Um, I need five vile fin scuffs from the Murlocs in the vicinity. You'll find them along the coast to the north. Got it. Okay, we're going to be here for about an hour killing Murlocs, so I hope you're ready for that. I'm not gonna lie, I love our character. I think I got a. I think he's got a cool look. I, I, the name is really growing. Up. Ooh, which one's got a better mock? Neither. Uh oh. Uh oh. Range, dude. Holy crap! This dude hits hard. I got evasion. I can't. I cannot forget. I might need it. Oh my lord, I might need it right now. No, 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 we're good. I love the sound of him. Yeah, am I the only one who's, act, like, absolutely obsessed with the Murlocs? I have a friend who hates the Murlocs because he's like, oh, they're just like, they're just a meme, you know, they're just like, they're not actually popular. They're popular for being popular. They're just, oh, I hate them. They're stupid and annoying and they never leave you. I'm like, I'm polar opposite. I'm like, dude, I love I love the noise they make. I love all the variants of them. I love that they're generally really annoying and they always get in our way. I'm going to make some more of these and just put them on my armor because why not? Anybody for 13, the family crypt 408? I don't know what that means. <laughs> Increase the item on the chest, hands, leg, or feet. I can't lose that. Wait, what is it? <laughs> my 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 uh my memory is not so good. Okay, uh, chest, legs, hands, or feet. Chest, legs, hands, so legs. Yeah, feet. Here we go. Show feet. Oh my lord! I gotta say, if I'm if I'm uh, if and when I make a hardcore guy, Murlocs. I love Murlocs, but I'm going to stay the frack away from them. Uh oh, the fact that they all run away and pull more, it, I, I'm 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 gonna have like PTSD nightmares if I'm playing on hardcore, and I'm fighting <laughs> the Murlocs. Oh my gosh. I remember this about Classic WoW. Is that Murlocs never drop what you need. That's like a... F oh, come on. That's like a fact of life. So I'm not gonna lie. I've been watching so many. I need to, like, stop. Because I'm gonna get, like, burned out. But I've been watching like so many WoW videos lately. Cause I've just been in the mood. I've been watching like top top ten hardest dungeons in World of Warcraft. Top ten like rarest mounts. <laughs> like all these all all those kind of videos. Top ten worst raids on like yeah, I know. I know what's going to be number one. And then I was thinking, what even was it? Can you remember? It's like Mogushan Vault, number three. I'm like, really? Jesus. Hey, look, we, <laughs> we finally got one. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. You know it's late when the clock... I don't even know when the last time I played WoW and the clock was like the moon symbol <laughs> like that. That's how you know it's late. Ooh, fish. I can, actually, I can, eat, I can eat that, can't I? I can't speak either. Oh... So I've been playing Final Fantasy 12. 
I nearly soft locked myself. I got I saved right before a boss and I couldn't go back. And I kept dying and I was like, oh my gosh. Like, is it over? Like I can't, you know, am I just screwed? I looked it up on the like I typed in the boss I was stuck on. And on the Wikipedia page for Final Fantasy XII, it's like, oh, this boss is a like a super easy boss, and players should have no problems beating it. I'm like, what? Like, what am I doing wrong? And I, what I didn't realize is I had just, before fighting this boss, I had just unlocked, like, the first summon for the game. And it's like, if you bring in the summon, he will literally just take out half the boss's health instantly. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so stinking stupid. I was like actually thinking, am I gonna have to re-roll? It's like, nah, it's the easiest boss in the game. It's cool though. I, I never played I've actually never played Final Fantasy XII before, but I was obsessed with ten growing up. It was my favorite one. And obviously, you know, twelve eleven was an MMO, so I didn't really care about that as a kid. But twelve was like the next real Final Fantasy game, you know, and I was like, oh I loved ten, so I was really excited for twelve. I remember it had like really cool promotional art. I remember the trailer for it and stuff. And I just never got it. I never played it. Fast forward 20 years, here I am, finally playing it. I need to get closer. But yeah, it's pretty cool. There's things I like about it, but I still kind of. I still prefer 10. I'm like seven hours in. It's like, okay. This is cool, but seven hours into ten, I was like, this is better. Yo, what up, Clurm? What it say, what it do? My bags are full. We're just killing Murlocs, because uh, we need crap, so we're hanging out. Oh yeah, late night gaming. Clarm. Murlocs. Yay or nay? Yeah, I need, I need bags. You know the crazy part? You know the really cool crazy part? On my other character, I made... Uh, like, I made, a, I made a gnome mage. You know, like two days ago, where I played like 20 minutes of uh, Season Discovery. The first 20 minutes of me playing, I think a six slot bag drop off trash in Dunmoro. I, I, this guy, I still have, I only have one bag. Isn't that crazy? Clerm is awake. Yeah. <laughs> Normally Clerm uh, is in bed because he's getting up at 2.30 in the morning. So this is like, this is like once in a year kind of time for him to be up. Night Owl for like a couple, <laughs> for a couple days, for like a week. Get back here, you son of a... Oh man, should I go sell crap? I'm like so full. I'm so full from all this topsoil. Um, patch of bat hair. What is this? Shiny seashell. I'm gonna get rid of the bat fur. Yeah, I think I need to sell. Is there a vendor nearby, or am I? I just gotta go all the way back to the grill, don't I? <laughs> Oh boy, here I go, running again. W Night Owl. Oh man, I, w I wish... This is my... This is my, like, my zone. I'm in the zone right now. Up till, like, 3 in the morning. That's my happy place. I like it. It's quiet. It's cold. Like, I like the night time. No, no matter where you are in the world, it's colder. You can open your window and there's usually, like, a nice cool breeze coming in. It's quiet. People aren't running around, blasting music, making noise. 
Right now I got all my Christmas lights on. So, oh, look, there's a... Look, it's Mort. Death Guard Mort. I love the nighttime. Average nighttime enjoyer versus... They said better be good. Virgin oh, daytime en enjoyer. <laughs> I got a mango flavored uh, white claw tonight as well. I swear I'm not I'm not normally a drinker. I don't drink every night like ever. But when you have a 50 pack of white claws that you need to drink before you uh, go traveling on a plane <laughs> in a few days, I, I have to have like three a day. And I can honestly say I don't think I would spend money on 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 a fifty pack of white claws. <laughs> Death Guard Lundmark. Okay, they're fine. I'll drink them, but they're really not like that tasty. I'm listening. Where is a vendor? Here we go, mushroom, mushroom dude. Balfin scale, big meaty claws. Ruined pelt. Hold on, what do I need for the uh, leather scraps? Okay, so I don't need that. This is uh, this is taking up a whole slot. I have to get rid of those broken bangs. I haven't. You know, I'm getting rid of the wolf meat. I haven't found a cooking trainer yet, and it's taking up space. You know. Oh, I should drink one of these. Yeah. I'm going to put this on my hot bar and I'm going to drink. Farewell. Farewell. I'm going to drink one of these when I get back to the Murlocs. Regenerate two health every five seconds for one hour. That's huge. Can I get huge in all caps? Heh <laughs> So-called free thinkers when I tell the chat what to do. Huge. But yeah, what else is going on? Final Fantasy XII. I've been playing Quake 2. Because I, I got Quake 1. I was in a boomer shooter mood. And I got Quake 1. I loved it. Then I played Dusk, Chop Goblins, got Quake Two, and I this this uh, this might be a pretty controversial opinion because I know the Quake fan base is pretty active. I went the wrong way, but <laughs> I know the Quake fan base is gonna be really up in arms about this. But I really don't like Quake Two compared to Quake One. Quake One had so much more like charm and personality to me quake 2 is just like it feels it feels more like generic doom knockoff now but uh yeah i don't know it's fine i spent like four dollars on it so i'm gonna play it and beat it but <laughs> i i really like quake one honestly if you're in a mood for like a classic kind of shooter and you've never played it the remake on Steam is really good. It's also like $3. But the music is by Nine Inch Nails. They did an amazing, really just like moody, atmospheric, kind of ambient soundtrack. Uh, it's great. I have the soundtrack on vinyl. Really cool soundtrack. Really environmental stuff. But yeah, two's not, two's not pulling me in. Sorry. Oh, look, someone, look, someone else is here. Here for you. Hey, it's that, it's the sexy gnome I saw earlier. Gnome priest. Homunculus? <laughs> Wait, hold on, how does she have pets? What is that? Hold on, what's her little pet? She's got like a pet. Oh man, she's pulling a lot. Careful. I'll, I'll save you, babe. I'm 
white knighting for a hot <laughs> for a hot uh, female gnome. Uh oh. Okay. <laughs> Get her number. I'm gonna go on like R slash missed connections and I'll be like We were on the north coast. It was one in the morning. You ran by, I don't even know if you if you saw me. But I knew from that moment that we were meant to be together. Turn your butt around. I also played a ton, not this week, but last week. Last two weeks, I put in probably like 30 hours into Enter the Gungeon. Oh, look, I think I completed the map. Wait, no, I don't. Oh, I need one more, one more. Screw me. Bottom right, top right, bottom left. Screw me. Well, kings. I would really like to finish the treasure map because it's taking up three whole slots now. But yeah, I stink and love Enter the Gungeon. It's really frustrating now. Because I... You will do, like, at least for me, I will do, like, an amazing run. I'm looking at the map. Fragment. I'll do an amazing run. And then the next 50 runs, I just get the absolute worst guns imaginable. Like, worst items and worst guns. And I'm, like, not... Like, I'd say I'm pretty good at the game, but I'm not good enough to beat every boss. I did pick it up. Yeah, no, I don't... I can't, I can't pick it up, because I already have that one. If you'll notice. I can't care. It's bottom right. I already have bottom right, so that's why it won't let me pick it up. But good eye. Can I take a pineum? No, there's actually four. I'm stupid and I read combined with three other pieces. I thought it meant that there are three total pieces. No, three other pieces mean this four. So, yeah, rip. Yeah, I feel like modern day WoW, if it says like combine, it, it might, I guess it might say combine with like, combine the three pieces or something. That would kind of imply that there's only three. I don't know. Numbers are weird, man. Ooh, big yawn. Big stretch. Ooh, big stretch. Dang, am I already out of rested XP? Rip. <laughs> Rested XP. What the heck, man? I was sleeping for 24 hours. I don't have enough energy. Start a new... Oh, you're right. Start a new guy and plant them in a stinking... Oh, I didn't drink a potion. Oh, you're right. I gotta make that guy, yeah. I should make a new guy and just plant him in an inn to start accumulating... Rest XP. I'm in power level, like, guys. That's like absolutely. I make sure all my alts are just in an in. Come on, give me the scale. Hardcore, yeah. I feel like with hardcore, you need all the help you can get, right? Like, you want as much rest XP, so you're not- uh-oh, uh-oh, potion time. Yeah, level 10. Level 10 nearly killed. Ooh, Malachite. That's huge. Oh yeah, look at that potion at work. Look at my health go. Look at my son go.
wonder what happened to that sexy gnome. <laughs> she came down to the beach with like a homunculus. Pulled the whole beach and then ran away. Herbalist potion maker. That could be good. Hey, there we go. There's all the scales. Okay, so we're gonna go uh, up here now. Because I think Mill's overrun. Forsaken Jutis. Travel South, Haunted Mills. Oh, wait, hold on. Is this. Where's this one? Agamond, Mills, Fell to the Plague. Oh, I think, yeah, I think that's the same. I think that I have a bunch of quests right here. Argamon family. Yeah, there's a ton of quests. Oh, there's a ton of quests over here. Hmm. I have to go in the mountains, I think. I was considering making a hardcore dude tonight. A hardcore duder, if you will. But uh, I was like, yeah, I'll just do a bit more of the rogue. More bones to now. Should I go back to town? I'm like halfway to town if I go this way. Sell some crap, go up there maybe. Where do I take the vial? Here's the question. New plague. Oh, that's in the that's in the basement, isn't it? I think that's the basement of the house. Gosh, it's hot in my room. And whenever I stream, it gets it gets stinking hot in my room because my computer or my laptop or whatever is always like kicking it into overdrive. But it should be cold. It should be cold at night. I'm gonna play. I, I'm gonna play in first person for a while. Actually, it's actually disorienting. <laughs> I hate it. Now I'm gonna now I'm gonna play an RTS. Mushroom farmer, hold on, hold on. Malachite. Uh, fish. Seashell. Malachite. I feel like it's, I could sell that on the auction house, couldn't I? But then again, that would require me to go into Undercity and find an auction house. So I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna Trust do that. No Trust no one. Oh, there's more. Apothecary Johan in the town of Brill wants you to bring him four samples of venom from a vicious night spider web. Goodbye. I can see about getting bags. Ooh, I don't know how much bags are gonna be though. Be quick, I guess I could buy it back from Malachite. Should we make a trip? Should we make a run into uh, Undercity? I have a quest to go to Undercity, I think. Present Severin's orders to Bethor Icechard in the Undercity. I don't know the details, but it deals with a wayward lich. It will be dangerous. Ready yourself, rogue. You must not fail. Part of me... here, here Here's the thing. Here's the sadistic thing. Part of me has always wanted to like play this game and read like all of the quest text i've tried it a few times 
and I always just give up after like an hour of playing. Huge Hoofner. Oh, look, look it's Hugh, it's Hugh Hoofner. <laughs> oh, that's a good name. That's a good one. That's a great name. I love your name. Thanks. <laughs> Hugh Hoofner, rest in peace. Man, our cat, cat, he, he's got to be what, 5% faster than me? I feel like cat form is supposed to be like 30% faster. Look how, <laughs> he's like really slow. <laughs> All right. Look at it. Sit. Twenty-seven months. What's going on? What's going on, Ram Dog? Oh crap! I missed the. <laughs> I missed the elevator. I was busy dancing. Looking fly. Thank you. Not a token. I like to wave at other people. What's going on, Rom Dog? We're just doing some late night leveling. General trade goods. Bat handler. He's the, he's the flight path, path, isn't he? Watch your back. You don't know any other flight Beware paths, you idiot. Um, where's the? Where's the auction house? Isn't it? Oh, cooking trainer. Oh, <laughs> I thought I was gonna fall into the goo. Cooking trainer, tell me everything. Oh, yeah. You know what that means. We can make a campfire, but actually in classic, you need ingredients. Ex-chef. <laughs> Ex-chef? Raleigh Andrian? In the bottom center? I think... Guild Tavern. I thought it was like in this ring. Isn't it out here somewhere? Here we go. Auctioneer. Let's wind back the clocks. Okay, hold on. Let's, um, how much is Malachite selling for? <laughs> Fort, f 14 copper. That's just how much it's worth. Gosh darn the economy. Um, what is container bag? Oops. Blue leather bag. What's the cheapest I can get? Six slot, six slot, six slot, six, 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 six. Eight, six, hold on, these prices are, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, how do you, hold on, hold on, hold on, buyout, let's do buyout price cheapest, six slot bag for one, for two copper, is that good, should I get a couple, They're like all two copper. I'm just gonna pick whoever's got a funny name. Some of these are two two thirty. Some of these are two fifty. These are just two three. Let's just get a couple of these. Griven buyout. I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy three. You know what? 
You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna buy four. YOLO. Because I realized if I buy three, I just need one more. And that's four bags. I don't want to. I don't have to run back in and out of town like every five minutes, like we had to do for the Merlot quest. Welcome to season of discovery, where I just do normal things and not discover. Oh, look at that! They are not very big. <laughs> They're not very big, but they get the job done. You know the crazy part? All these bags are totaled to 32. And and stinking in retail, everything is a 32 slot bag. Eight slot bags are worth 25 silver. Okay, yeah, I got a good deal. Slaps bag. <laughs> you can fit a moderate amount of loot in this here bag. I love the Undercity, though. I mean, it's never been my favorite capital city, but I, it's, it's moody. It's really visually... Like, the colors are just so strong. Really vibrant purples, really vibrant green. Hey, look, Time Splitter. <laughs> so that, that guy's probably not even playing. He's probably going to get DC for being AFK too long. I stink and love time splitters, though. That guy's going to message me. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Shrek's wife? <laughs> like, I need to get closer. oh, he's too far away. <laughs> it's stinking. It's <laughs> I love that. They don't even know Fiona's name. They're just like Shrek's wife. <laughs> Oh crap, wait, don't I have a quest to find someone in, in, um, crap. Hold on. The magic order. I almost, I almost just left the stupid city. There's Time Splitter. <laughs> Time Splitter, Shrek's wife. Gooeyeb. Look at this dude. Gooeyeb. Why do you have to be touching somebody to inspect them? What is this crap? I'm out of range. Look at this dude, he's a beast. I love the Torin. I really should just join like an RP server because I swear I'm always I'm always RP like eighty percent of the time. It's bedtime for me. Oh, it is late. I assume yeah, you gotta work tomorrow, don't you? Rip. And you are. And you are. Well, thanks for showing up, Rom Dog. Get some sleep. It's late, so go get some. Get some good rest. I'm gonna be up until uh, I'm gonna be up for four more hours. So it said he's in the magic quarter, isn't he? You may find Be Bethor. Is it Bethor or Bethor? You might find the Bethor in the magic quarter of the Undercity. Want to sell free action potion. 11 for 4G. I should message him and say that doesn't sound very free. Salazar Block. Hello. Cool. Where <laughs> where's the where's the quest? Fungus vendor. <laughs> Another sexy gnome. <laughs> I feel like the, I feel like he's around here somewhere. There he is. Yes, I knew it. Look, look, look. There he is. Prodigal Lich. I got beef sticks in the fridge. Ooh, you're making me hungry. Hello. 
Hello. Greetings. There is a lich who dwells on the island in Brightwater Lake. Because he is forsaken, the queen wants him. If he is skilled in necromancy, he will be useful. Steal into his camp and find his spellbook. Bring the spellbook back. Man, really? You want me to go all the way up? Like, up? Outside the city, go to a lake, find a book, and come all the way back? It's a lot of walking, dude. I actually had beef, uh... Well, not really beef jerky. I had, like, steak strip, steak jerky, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's our neighbors. The ones who gave us all the beer, they gave me, like, a pack of beef jerky. And I haven't had beef jerky or steak jerky or whatever in, like, so long. I think it was from Costco. It said, like, beef, beef strips or uh, steak strips on the front of it. I think I ate that thing in, like, a week. It's like the perfect midnight snack. Like after I've had dinner and I'm staying up late and I'm playing a game or I'm watching a show or something, it's like, man, I want something savory. Cause here's the thing for me. I don't know about y'all. I feel like I'm a little I feel like I'm a little weird, but I don't usually get like a sweet tooth in the middle of the night. Like if it's past midnight, I don't I don't want to go and get a bunch of candy and have a ton of sweet stuff. I, I, I'm always in like a savory mood at midnight. That's why I always used to have like top ramen at like one in the morning. I want something, I, I want like something meaty or like cheese or just savory. Something not, not sweet. That's my go-to. I might have, like, cheese and crackers or something. I feel like the tendency is to want something sweet, though. And I know there's something to that. I know, I don't, I know, I don't know what it is, but I'm pretty sure, like, if you are constantly craving, like, sweet things, it means your body is, like, low on whatever and if you constantly want savory things it's, it means you're like you know low on vitamin d or whatever there's like some there's something to it i swear i looked up i'm not making it up i swear forsaken duties travel along the road find her talk to her no no Proof of Demise. Where is this one? A ruined tower southwest of Brill. Oh, I think I'm next to that, aren't I? Oh, no, Brian. Oh, no, no. It's, it's like down here, isn't it? Hold on. I guess I still gotta kill bats. Hold on, what is what is RFC? That guy's selling want to sell RFC carry rods. Razor that's not Razor Fan Keep. It's not Razor Fan Crowl. What's RFC? Oh, Ragefire Chasm. I'm stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Orgamon. Classic. Man, I haven't done original Ragefire Chasm in so long. I've done the reworked RFC a gajillion times when power leveling. Okay, is it ASMR for anyone else when I do the skinning sound effect? One hour of skinning sound effect, please. All right, Carol, what's your favorite capital city in the game? And why is it Shatra? Let's 
Stormwind. Classic. You can't go wrong with Stormwind. Simple, yeah. I mean, it's 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 the epitome of like a good design city. Like you know where everything is. The portal, like the way to get to the portals, makes sense. What? <laughs> that bat I was just fighting just pieced out. Silver Moon is a second. I love Silver Moon. I absolutely love Silver Moon. I think the layout of it sucks, but I love the look of it, the aesthetic, the music, everything. Yeah, Blood Elves are like one of my favorites. Like I said, I think all the armor looks good on a Blood Elf. There's the ruined tower. Colonel, I've located the ruined tower. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. Yeah, I love Silver Moon. I love Thunder Bluff. I like Orgrimmar. I remember it before they changed it, but the funny thing is, I've... You know, I've played... And been in Orgrimmar now more, more in the in the remake than in the original version. You know, like I can only vaguely remember what the original version was like. Now, now the new version is permanently engraved in my head. I like Ironforge too. I know a lot of people like on the Reddit are always complaining and saying like, "I wish that was the Alliance capital." I like Ironforge. And even though I'm a lifelong druid, night elf, Darnassus, I love the uh, the aesthetic of Darnassus, but the layout, I hate the layout. It's not fun to navigate. Getting like, oh, where, where's the clock? Like, where, where do I get fishing training? Like, oh, I gotta go, gotta go. Oh, all the way over up here. Okay, there's the fishing guy now. It looks great, though. It's like really beautiful aesthetically. So different than all the other capital cities. Um, like, we gotta be careful around here. I'm gonna try to pickpocket this dude. Oh, a shiny apple. Nice. Oh, I gotta be careful. Oh, I gotta be real careful. Oh, lord. I love Dar- or not Dar- it's a Dalaran. Like, Legion Dalaran. Um, Wrath of Lich King Dalaran. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. It's fine. This is fine. I just love that there, there's so many secrets and, and Easter eggs, and there's so much to do in Dalaran. Like, I'll never forget Legion Dalaran. There was so much to do. Like, you could go looking for little hidden things for toys or pets. There were, like, hidden vendors that only showed up at certain times of the day. Oh, this is not good. I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna eat. It would be better if they had an auction house. See, that is the thing. I'm, I'm always an engineer. So, if you're an engineer, there is an auction house in Dallas, so it never bothered me. But you're right, if you're not an engineer, no auction house sucks. I don't have enough energy. 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 Two banks and two auction houses. Yeah, it's overkill. It's so much. <laughs> yeah, I, I love, I love Dallas. What you mean? Well, if you're an engineer in Dalaran, the engineering trainer had a robot standing next to him that could be used as an auction house.
mind blown. Also, there's the whole postal uh, postman mini game in Dalaran. I got a really, I have a, I have a title that nobody stinking has in detail for doing the postman mini game. Scarlet Zealots. I need a. Oh man, look, my weapon is breaking. What other cities are there? I've never really big, been a big fan of Shatrath. I think it was cool in concept. Like, it was really cool when it came out in novel. It's like, wow, you know, Alliance and Horde next to each other, and we're not fighting. Whoa! But other than that, it's not really too interesting to me. Scarlet Zealot. We need one more of these. Um, what are the cities are there? Stinking Shadowlands City. That's gotta be one of the worst capital cities. Oh, you know what? I love... This might be a hot take, but I love Borealis from BFA. Uh-oh. This place sucks. I'm like pulling left and right. I really liked Borealis. Um, Dazara lore was okay. I liked the Siege of Dazara lore raid, but the city was not... It wasn't my favorite. I, I preferred Borealis. Oh, jeez. But yeah, I really like that. Um, Dragonflight. What's uh, Valdraken? It's pretty good. It's not my favorite, but I, I like it enough. It's 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 a city designed around hopping on your dragon, and flying around, and I feel like it works. Okay. Can I line of sight Captain Perrine? Oh, screw me. Not good. Not happy, Bob. Not happy. I have to keep stunning her. Oh, should I have stunned him and focused her? Oh, it's over. Oh! <laughs> Rip! I'm dead. Oh, I'm all the way here? Screw you. Dang. Second death, ladies and germs. Yeah. Hardcore run over. Well, it would have been it would have been over last night. Oh, I'm going the wrong way too. Oh, I'm going the wrong way too. Where were the cities? There wasn't really a... Oh, what's it? Wow. In War with the Drainer, what was it called? Um, War Spear. There wasn't really like capital cities in Warlords. It was just like War Spear, wasn't it? That one kind of sucked. They really, I mean, really, the garrison was your capital city. I think that's all the cities, right? Haven't I talked about them all? When are we going to get Nomra gone? I've been saying for 20 years. Okay, maybe not that long. I've been saying for 15 years that it would be cool if we actually took back Nomra gone. And the gnomes had their own capital city. Want to sell toughened leather gloves. Whoa, those are sick. Dang. Captain Perrine. How do I... Oh, man. How do I do this? I don't think I can kill them both. Because uh, I'm going to pull both of them. Oh, there's a chest in there too. I can't drink any more yet. 
Yeah. Okay, hold on. I need, I need to think. There's two. They're both level. Oh, you know, I probably, I just, I probably just gotta come back later. Too many guys to fight on my own. I'm for with the Scarlet Crusade. Yeah, there's a lot of quests up like north. Let's. uh... I forgot the name. Wasn't the city? Isn't it? Isn't it? Is it not War Spear? What's it called? Wasn't really a city. Neither of them were. Death in the family, haunted mills. Where's the quest for the lich? Oh, here we go. Um, to discover, uh, you must seek his, steal into his camp and acquire it for me. There's a lich who dwells on the island in Bright, Brightwater Lake to the north. Brightwater Lake. Still, oh, that's a pond. Where's the lake? Is it over? It's got to be over here somewhere, right? Yeah, we'll get that later. Oh, my weapon. Uh, my weapon's gonna be broken. I hate everything. Let's repair my weapon in town. We'll go up here. There's a lot. There's like three quests here. We can do that. That'll take us like an hour. I kind of forget how... How much time you, you... Well, at least you can spend in the starting zone. Look at another person. It's crazy, you know, because in retail, it's like, you're in the starting zone, what, 10 minutes, 20 minutes? It's like, okay, off to the next zone. Oh, hold on, bat. Classic, it's like, you get like five, six hours in the starting zone, if you're slow. Isn't, isn't, um... Mega boots. Isn't Season of Discovery only up to level 25 as well? I'm like... I'm like almost... I'm almost one-fifth of the way there. Okay, where is... I need someone who can repair my crap. Sludge Breath. Oh, that's a great... Hello. I hate to say it, but that guy probably randomly generated his name, but that's a great name. <laughs> Sludge Breath. Oh, look, Slumber Sand. I could probably actually put that to use. Um... Who can repair my stuff? I'm out of range. I haven't got all day. I haven't Goodbye. got all day. Isn't there like a? Oh, over here, over here. Here we go. I just hit. Oh, I just hit repair all. I meant to click the. I meant to click this, but I don't, okay, whatever. Nothing's gonna break anytime soon. Across from the end. See, you do. You do know your stuff. Power to the forsaken. <laughs> oh, like other guy said hello to me, but it didn't say anything. I'm surprised that his character didn't go, hello. Look at me and this dude. Look at us. It's like one in the morning and we're just two dudes. Exploring at night. This is living the dream. I'll tell you what, I've got a, I've got a mini Ghirardelli peppermint chocolate. I told you I don't have a sweet tooth at night, but I lied.
Ah, bats. Here we go. So has anybody seen any good shows or movies lately? I think I'm, I mentioned it like... I think I mentioned it playing Zelda last time. Oh, look, it's Gordo! Uh, but I've been rewatching the whole Gundam Universal Century in chronological order. And it's been really pretty darn great. Although I've been watching, instead of watching all the shows, I've been watching the compilation movies. And I would highly recommend not doing that. Because it's a cool idea to convert a whole, so say there's a whole uh, 50 episode TV show. It's a good idea to be like, hey, can we trim that down into three, like two hour long movies, you know? Just to make it easier, right? If you want to rewatch it or whatever. It's a good idea, but uh, it is just so, like, stinking breakneck fast paced, and they cut out so much stuff to get them into the length of three movies. It's like. I don't know. I can't recommend watching it to anybody. It's like. Maybe if you're, like, 1% interested in Gundams and you just want, like, a really. If you want to take, like, the Cliff Notes expedited class version of watching the show, it's, it's, I need to get closer. it's too much. If I ever rewatch, like, all of the Universal Century stuff, I'm just gonna watch the shows again. Movies are just, I won't say they butcher it, but, uh, it's too much. Waiting for the Fallout series. I didn't watch the trailer. Because I don't watch trailers for anything anymore. Um, but I just know there was a lot of negative feedback about the trailers. <laughs> and that there's a Cyclops guy that has made people very mad. I don't actually have a problem with the Cyclops. People are saying it makes no sense. Why would there be a Cyclops in a vault? Like the vaults are kept underground. It doesn't make sense. I'm like, my first instinct was just... Well, every stinking vault in the universe is like a different messed up social experiment. So, like, who's to say that this vault wasn't the vault where Vault Tech was like, Hey, why don't we flood this vault with radiation and just see what happens? And it's like, oops, we made some, like, one-eyed beats or whatever. It's like, that That to me is, it's like, I don't know. That's a, that's a silly thing to be, like, up in arms about. can't carry anymore but yeah i don't know i i I'd, i probably won't watch it i don't know i still haven't watched the halo show i don't know if i ever will and i don't know if i'll watch fallout show not gonna lie though i i, I quite liked the last of us show i didn't think i was gonna like it but i think they did a pretty good job And I'm really interested in season two, how much they're going to change or leave the same as the game. Too far away. Welcome to I spent all night fighting stinking bats and murlocs. I think that's all I've done tonight. <laughs> I've skinned. I've walked around, I fought bats, I fought murlocs. That is literally it. And I bought a bunch of bags. Ooh, ooh, look, we got the... Oh, I love these skeletons. They remind me of uh, Orc Arena of Time, the mini-bosses in the Forest Temple. You know what I'm talking about? Does anybody know what the heck I'm talking about? Okay, um... Chill of death. No, uh, what is it? Cryptomize. Haunted mills. Find Devil and Agamond. Kill his family. Mills overrun. To get to the mills, follow the road, rest across the road, go north. Um, oh, yeah, look, 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 here we go. Collect notch ribs from rattle cage and crack skull. Soldiers. 
Oh, from Rattle Cage and Crack Skull Soldiers. And Blackened Skulls from Dark Eyed Bob Casters. Okay. So we gotta kill a bunch of these guys. And we are we're gonna ding a little bit. Exciting. By a little bit, I mean like in half an hour. I'm out of range. Do that yet. <sighs> Man, I haven't. Oh, I don't even know, like, if there's any TV coming out that I'm like excited for. <laughs> I haven't been watching much TV or anything. Ooh, practice sword. Here I am re-watching, like, old shows from 40 years ago. What, about half an hour? I said, I'll, it'll, I said it'll probably take me half an hour to gain this level. Look how close I am. I'm exaggerating, but that's really... Hey, Black and Skull. Oh yeah, no, I won't take half an hour. Look, that uh That's filling up pretty quick. I need to... I'm here all night. Oh right. I'll be here all week. Are you not tired? You haven't eaten like all day, right? Hmm. I don't know if I haven't eaten. If I don't eat like all day, because every now and then I'll like intermittently fast where I'll like, I won't eat all day until dinner. Or maybe I'll just have breakfast and I won't eat the rest of the day. I'll do that every now and then. But if I do that, like if I don't keep really busy, like, if I don't keep my hands or mind busy, I'll just be sitting there and my stomach will just be rumbling, like, all day. Ding! Battle ding! Oh, that was perfect. Perfect! Now I'm fighting Devlin Agamond. I totally meant to do that. He's a cool model, though. Look at this dude. Can make some bandages. I'm tired, but I'm chilling. All right. What the heck? Devlin Agamon spawned immediately. Look. <laughs> this is getting out of hand. Now there are two of them. Hopefully the rare is up. Ooh, where is he normally? Is he just wandering around? It is late. <laughs> so there's a chance nobody's killed him if he's respawned. Rattle cage, dark eye, rattle cage, rattle cage, rattle cage. A lot of just normies wandering around. He's in one of the farm plots. Okay, okay. I can't do that yet. Cracked skull. Cracked skull. Oh, look, there's another person. Oh, it's Marge. <laughs> Marge Simpson, look, she's got the hair. Tell me. Tell me a plane. Hold on, hold on. Tell <clears throat> me. Mm. Okay, I'm tired. I'm tired. It's too late. I can do Marge during the day. Kind of like just sneaking around. Gregor Agamon. That's one of the guys I have to kill, isn't it? 
Gregor. Gregor Agaman. A clan the Gregor. Let's go frick him up. Mm -hmm. Odd melon. I'm still seeing odd melons everywhere. What is that? Why are there melons? It's so weird. I kind of want to keep breaking them until I get like cool loot out of it. But Marge, the cool melons are everywhere. Too far. Oh crap. <laughs> right when I pulled this guy, that Gregor's moving on. Uh oh, he's coming my way. Dude, dude, back off, man. Back off me, man. Back off me. Dude, 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 come on, hurry up. I want to kill Gregor. I'm just gonna pull him. It's for mages. Oh, okay. Do you like do you like dispel them or something? Because they're all poly polymorph. That's how they get a room. Oh, interesting. Oh, you know what? I wonder if I should be like pickpocketing more people. To try and get my roots. Got egg guys to their mains. Nice, nice, nice. Um, dang, I don't have any food. I can't cannibalize either. I just gotta sit here a minute. Ooh. <clears throat> okay, um, who else is there? Gregor, we got Gregor, there's Thurman, and Nissa. I think one of them's in the house. Darth Vader, in the house. And I don't know if, like, the last one is over here by these windmills or something. Is it like playing music? I swear I can't hear anything. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello. I was checking my music. Oh, look, there's Thurman. Look, look, look. I found Thurman. Thanks for the skull, bro. So there's Thurman. So I'm thinking the girl, she's got to be at the house and it's uh. Come on, come on, he's getting away. <laughs> he's getting away really slowly. Ow! You're gonna pull the ball. Oh, dude. Sneaking. It's not even funny how slow I am. I mean, it's kind of funny. Oh, man, I was listening. Okay, so I was doing some studying and some work earlier today. But I was listening. Yesterday and today, I've been listening to the Sims 1 soundtrack. Gosh, if that doesn't make you want to play a game, I don't know what will. But listening to that 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 OG classic soundtrack, oh my god, oh my gosh, this is so, it's so stinking good. I don't know how a game like that old, and it's just, it's just so weird. They're like, okay, we're making a game about like playing little like humanoid creatures, and you control all their movements. How about like the best jazz music you've ever heard your whole life. 
Okay, I'm gonna pull a Thurman. I need to get closer. I need to get closer. I'm like just completely surrounded on all sides. I need to be careful. Seriously, if you've never listened to the Sims 1 soundtrack, just type in Sims 1 OST on YouTube. The first hour. It's all good music, but the first hour is absolutely perfect. No joke, for real, for real. Yo, what up, Ikai? Oh! Okay, we're good. How's it going, son? What kind of character am I building? Well, I am a rogue. Um, and I haven't, like, gotten any, like, cool new moves or anything really interesting from, like, the Season of Discovery other than, like, a starting move, so I'm kind of just rogue. <laughs> I might be doing the Season of Discovery wrong, because I don't know, like, anything about it, but, uh, yeah, I'm just sneaking around. Look, it's Pavlovo. It's a good name. And Zigum. Tattersail. There's like a lot of people around here right now. But what's going on, Ignite? How's it going? I think we're looking for Nisa. Nisa, she's in here. Oh, crap. Oh crap! Get her off me, dude! I'll help you if you help me! I'll help you, don't worry, I'll help you! I gotcha. I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. Look at this! Look! Look at this, dude! <laughs> this like stealth comes out of this stealth rogue comes out of nowhere. He just says, "Nice." March. Okay, not gonna lie, I was the first one here. Can somebody please help? No, no, no! Please, somebody help me to kill Lisa. Those dudes just came in, killed her, and ran off. No, no, no. That's not how this works. Oh, see, look. This guy's helping me out. This guy's a pro. Enjoying time with the fam. Nice, nice. Is your sister home? Because I know you got a present for uh, Christmas. So I assume she's back. Okay, what else do I need to kill? Blackened skulls. Let's get this guy. I don't have enough energy. I don't have enough energy. Like oh, nice, nice. We got all the skulls. Now we just need ribs and we're... I think we're done here. We got Devlin. Yeah, yeah. This area went actually a lot smoother than I thought it would. Didn't find that rare, though. Yeah, me and, uh, me and Juice have been staying up, well, pr late for him. <laughs> late for him playing games, because he's never, uh, up this late. I'm really hoping in the new year I don't have to get up super early for work, though. I just got my fingers crossed. Oh dang, level 6? This guy's a chump. Look, there's level 6 and level 9 right next to each other. What is this crap? Oh, 
Like right before, I don't know, I think it was Wednesday or Thursday. I need to get closer. I need to get closer. I met up with the girl, so I'm getting I'm putting I'm getting put on like a different team. But the project I'm getting put on for work only has one person working on it. So it's this girl. And I've been kind of like helping her out the past few months, just like a little bit. Like only 10% of my time has been side project. My boss is like, I'm putting you on this project 100%. And last time I spoke with her, which was like the Wednesday of a couple weeks ago. Um, I guess it would be last week, wouldn't it? It was like Wednesday. And she was just like, uh, so like, how do you want to do this? Do you want me to like make stories or whatever and like you try and get them done or i'm like yeah it was like super informal i thought she i, I thought it was gonna be like oh okay so like i've got this and you need to do this and we need to meet up daily to do this this and this or whatever it's like it was like super informal I'm like oh please let's just keep it like let's just keep it chill because it's like if it's just me and her working on this project like i need to get closer i don't know as long as we're making progress, do we really need to, like, have tons of meetings and, and, like, do all the, like, jump through all the hoops that you normally do? So, we'll see. We'll see. But I have a feeling in the new year they'll be like, we want you to attend all these meetings. And also your team is on the East Coast, so you have to get up at 6 in the morning. So, rip me if that happens. Okay, um, so, oh, Captain, oh, yeah, we haven't killed Captain per Perrin. Forsaken Judies. I want to see if the, blah, 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 blah. Room has that the spiders can be found in Eastern Tears Fall Glades. Got it. Oh, I need to kill more bats still. We need some more bat uh, pelt, and I can buy a co coarse thread. Then we've done a lot of the quests. I don't have Let's say we're making all right progress. Should get... I don't think we'll get a level, but we should get some good XP for turning in all these quests. Have I put... Hold on. I'm just going to enchant all my armor real quick. Pants, there we go. Yeet. Oh yeah, look at that. Plus eight armor. Everything counts, right? Oh look, it's Necro Spire. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Too far away. Nice to meet you. Three more, or no, I'm sorry, two more bat things. Alright, what's the last song you guys got stuck in your head? I tell you what, today. I'll tell you what. Uh, there's a remix, there's an Undertale remix of Caramel Dancing that was on my feed on YouTube, and that's been stuck in my head all day, because it, it goes hard. It's so all day I've been thinking, Caramel dancing. Have a target. Burn it down. I don't actually know what that is. DJ Khaled. The 
the key is to find somebody to take care of my plants like I take care of them. Now that's gonna be hard. That's a <laughs> that's a that's a profound quote. There's actually a lot of layers to that quote. <laughs> oh, that reminds me, I was on. I, every now and then, I go on like a Wikipedia, like a, a rabbit trail on Wikipedia, and. I was okay. Here's how it started. I was on the Bing Crosby Wikipedia page, and I get down to the bottom where he died, and there was a whole section. There was a blue link for like his his last words. He has like famous last words because when he died, he said something, and it was it's a famous it's a famous quote. And there was a link that was like famous last words or whatever. And I click that and it takes me to another Wikipedia page. And there's like a whole huge article of like famous last words. And it's like categorized, and it's split up. It's really funny. I, de I, I recommend checking it out. There's like, the, it, the sections are like ironic last words funny last words like awesome last words it's literally split up into all these sections and one one of them one of the one of the famous last words is in the uh in the ironic section it says something like like oh um i don't know it's a guy like shooting a gun or something he made a gun and he's like this is like the greatest gun ever made and the and it's like from from like Bill Colt or whatever. It's like five minutes before shooting himself on accident or whatever. <laughs> like like that's the ironic quote. It's just like what is this? So there's so many of those. Good stuff. It's a fun it's a fun rabbit trail to click through. Or one of them is like, what are you gonna do, shoot me? And it was like famous last words, like the guy like this guy said this one minute before getting shot in the face. <laughs> like that's it, that's the famous last words. What are you gonna do? Shoot me? My favorite my personal favorite last words are from from the the, the world renowned artist Tiny Tim. Who's a personal favorite of mine. And and the story goes like this. He was up on stage performing. Singing his music. Playing instruments. And he had a heart attack. When he was on stage. And he runs off stage. Like clutching his chest. And his wife is backstage. And she comes up to him. And she says like oh my gosh honey are you okay? And his last words are, "Do I look like I'm okay?" And then he drops dead. That'll that lives that lives rent free in my head, because Tiny Tim is like the funniest. Like if you don't know who he is, go look up Tiptoe Through the Tulips. He's such a weird, but funny and just like fascinating character. He's a he's he's a character to say the least. And to imagine him just like angrily saying, Do I look like I'm okay? And then just dying. There's something really funny about that. I don't have enough energy. Stink a lot of tiny Tim. Kids these days don't know who he is, I bet. kids these days they never heard a musical comedy act from 50 years ago I still want my beef sticks go get them uh, you want any dead sticks I want you to go re I want to go rethink my life uh, I want to go rethink my life I don't want to sell you any dead sticks uh, I don't want to sell you any statistics. Sell 
so much work. <laughs> what is your it's is your fridge like down 18 flights of stairs? It's now or never, fam. You either get those beef sticks right now or you're gonna go to sleep and you're not gonna have them tonight. Yeah, hey, I don't wanna get beef sticks. Okay, so we're back here. What I'm thinking... This is gonna be really hard. Not gonna lie. Oh lord. Stealth mission. I need to kill the guard out front, for real, for real. Please don't pull everyone and die. A oh, dude saw me? Oh, man. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna kill this guard. Then I'm gonna go in and use the sleep sleep dust on the one guy. Put him to sleep for 20 seconds and try and kill the other guy before that. Leather. Ooh, not an upgrade rip. Can't I just equip a shield for like five minutes? I've stink got a free hand. Okay, here we go. And here we go. Put that dude to sleep. Alright, let's do this. I got 20 seconds. Is this enough time? Oh lord. If he, if he, if he keeps parrying, I'm gonna be screwed. I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong button. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go! Let's go! Yes! Okay, can I kill this dude? Can I kill this dude and get the chest? Oh, it's gonna be close. Come on, combo. Let's go, let's go. Can I get a woo in all caps? Oh, what? This isn't a real chest? Screw you. I redact that. Don't say woo. Rip. Okay, well, we've got a lot of quests to turn. If I buy one coarse thread, we got some good XP coming. And I'm going to drink some water. Stay hydrated, by the way, my friends, if you're still awake. Stand up, uh, stretch, maybe walk around a little. So here's the nice thing about drinking a lot of tea. If you don't put sugar or any crap in your tea, like I just do a splash of milk in mine. It's like 90% water. So I used to hate drinking water. I don't hate water anymore. I'm like, uh, you know, I've, I've become accustomed to it. But if you drink a lot of tea throughout your day, that there's your daily water. We think I need to do like how many ounces is it a day? Like 52 ounces of water? I don't know. I can't remember. It's like a, it's a lot of glasses of water you're supposed to drink a day. Go drink some tea. That'll, uh, that'll knock off a few cups of water you've got to drink. We got a lot of crap to sell, too. I couldn't find a knife to... Open the beef sticks. Ooh, can you tear it open with your teeth? Or is it like gonna destroy your teeth if you do that? We've got a lot to sell. Let's get going. And you are 
It would hurt. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, little one. Ruined pelt. Those are good for nothing, aren't they? Ruined pelt. Meaty bat wing. Is there a recipe for that for cooking? I don't think so. Watch over you. Dark lady, watch over you. That sucks, though. Do you, do you have any scissors? Are there any scissors nearby? Dang. Dang, I could make some... Okay, hold on. Is this a good... No, it's not an upgrade. I should make... You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just going to make sink in all of these light armor kits because I want to level my leather working a bit. Also, I just now noticed this guy's name is Ratslin Main. He's got a rat in his name. Oh wait, where's the um hold up, where's the where's the leatherworking trainer again? Let's see if I can get any recipes. Dark lady, watch over Dark Lady, watch over you. Remember Look, there's a ton of dudes out here. It's like two in the morning. The putrid one. Jedar scene. Backstabbied. Have lava again. <laughs> See, this is what I love about WoW. Like, look, it's Pav... Or, no, where'd he go? He ran up there. Pavlovo. Like, me and him, just like 10 minutes ago, we were fighting uh, Nisa together. And, like, he helped me and I helped him. It's just cool to see the same people, like, again and again while you're leveling. Play a Slay Captain Vashon and Five Scarlet Fires. I love the little... I love the camaraderie of when you keep bumping into people. Or maybe you keep uh, like queuing with people for like Dungeon Finder. Is that better be good? Is it better be good? Yes. Have Lavo. It's a good name. Oh, Chip Claw. Hold on, I should sell these things. What do you require? What do you require? <laughs> what? Mm, what do you require? Where's the where's the leather guy again? Leather. Oh, hold on. Isn't leather? Oh, leather dude's like leather workers all the way over there. Is Let me turn in all my quests and everything. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Gotta buy coarse thread too. See, I get I, here's the thing. I'm playing stinking classic and I get distracted so easily. My thing is like if I'm playing retail, I really have to like I have to hone in on something. When I log in, I have to be like, okay, I'm going to do mog runs today or I'm going to try and do dungeons today or whatever because I'm just going to get too distracted. There's just so much going on. <laughs> Got new gloves, baby. Mm, let me sell these cards real quick. I'm listening. Oops. Do not seek death. Okay, what else? Oh, we have one more quest to turn in, and then then I gotta figure out what the heck we're gonna do. We're gonna be ten. When? Okay, hold on. When? When is a good time to leave Tears Fall Glades? I mean, we're gonna be ten, but there's still. The whole eastern half. Am I going to be like 15 by the time I go to Silver Pine? What is it? Farewell. 
What is it, Outlander? Remember, Remember the sun. Okay, so now we need to figure out what we're doing. Scarlet Insignia. Speak with the guy to the right. At the ruined tower in South East Tears Fall near Balnir Farmstead on the command of Captain Bashan. South East Tears Fall? So North South East. So over here. New Plague. That's just kill spiders. Family Crypt. Oh, this is to go back... That's to go back up to Agamond Mills. I don't really want to do that right now. Also, that quest is orange. So, let's do this one. That one. Kill spiders. Lich's identity. I know the leather worker guy is over here too. Man, I stink and I'm a I, I'm a broken record, but I haven't said it at all. Tonight. I said it a lot last night, but I stink and love this game. <laughs> Even though I'm basically just playing WoW Classic because I don't know what the season of discovery is, and I've only got one move. Return to Magistrate Severin. Watch your back. Kill bleeding horrors, wandering spirits. Beware the living. Hello. Hand stitched pants. Hold on, what do I get unavailable? What's like the next recipe? 60. Oh, 25. Oh, hold on. Look, I can make uh, I can make new stuff if I just get a few more levels. Bye. Okay, so I can make a new belt. A quiver. Oh, you guys remember when there was a quiver? Increased range attack speed. Oh, can I use a quiver? No, I can't use a quiver, can I? Eight slot quiver. Small leather pouch. Curved hide. Yeah, no, no, those are too interesting. Um... I think the belt might be good. Oh yeah, that, oh that's good, but that's a lot of uh, that's a lot of light leather. Seven and one. Yeah, I should probably make it. What now? Fishing supplies. Oh snap! Is there a fishing trainer trainer around here? Can't learn that spell. Did I just Quick buy two? Do not seek death. I haven't got all day. I accidentally bought two of them because my mouse is broken and I clicked it twice. Ask no one. Um. Return to Magistrate Severn with the information in Brill. I'd have me be the stinking postman just running back and forth. Oh dang, I'm getting close to ten. If I could get to ten, that'd be that'd be pretty okay uh, progress for tonight. So yeah, let's uh, let's shoot for ten. How about that? Cause I'm getting a little, I'm getting a little tired. I'm not gonna pass out or anything, but uh, my eyes are getting a little. Okay, general supplies. What do you require? What do you require? No, not this one. Uh, coarse, coarse thread. I'm gonna use all my leather on a stupid belt. Yep. 
Yeet. I know it's probably the least interesting leveling zone, but my favorite is still Mulgore. I have the utmost nostalgia and, and like, love for Mulgore and the Tauren people. Where are you running off to, Sat Savan Bloodshot? If I could live in the World of Warcraft, I would want a house by the lake in Mulgore. I feel like, I mean, I know it got kind of messed up by the Cataclysm, but I just feel like it's its like centrally located Kalimdor. It's just peaceful and beautiful. You can get to Orgrimmar quickly. You're right on, uh, you're right next to Thunder Bluff. It's like, it's prime real estate, you know? I don't want to be in the big city, but I want to be close to the big city. Does that make sense? Where would you guys live if you could put a house in World of Warcraft? Look, a fishing guy. Clyde Kellett. Screw you, Clyde. Hello. Teach me. Teach me the ways of fishing. Beware. Oh, man. Fishing is my absolute favorite. You guys don't even know how much I love fishing. And lucky for you, I don't have a fishing rod. <laughs> so you guys don't have to suffer through me fishing. This is a spooky lake, though. I wouldn't want a house by this lake. It's kind of eerie. So we're going out onto this island to try and find, I think, evidence of who the lich is. Apparently he's got a book with his name written in it. I want to watch some fishing. I love fishing. I love it. And, and the funny thing is, well... I've never, uh, I've done it in real life, right? But I did it when I was probably five, six, seven, eight years old. Every like summer, my parents would just like drive me down to Oregon and leave me at my grandparents' house all summer. And you know, my grandpa would take us fishing and I hated it. But now I'm thinking older and I've, I've grown up playing fishing in every game I've ever played. And I always love it when it's like a mini game. I think I would like it. I think I would pr probably find it relaxing. Um, but I haven't, like, stinking actually done it as an adult. Gunther Arcanus. He's got a pointy wizard hat. I'm not so sure about this guy. Okay, he's got a book. Here we go. Book with Gun Gunther's books. Just going to try and yoink this. Nice. Oh, man. Tactical. Holy crap, Gunther's level 53. I don't want to mess with that dude. He's definitely the lich. He's like an immortal lich. <laughs> he just wants to fish. Okay, so that's that. Um, where's this? Where's this quest? Um, patrol east and slay any scourge you find. Spend particular efforts at the... Balnir Farmstead to the east. So I can put that on the queue. I don't want to go back to there just yet. Proof of Demise is just Duders. Okay. Um, yeah, let's do either. We'll do either this one for killing people. Or this one for just killing random dudes as we find them. We should be 10 pretty quickly though. Man, these undead have the wonkiest swim animation. Look at this. He's like lunging for... a. He's like jumping up for a basketball or something. Look at that. Like, hey! Also, I forgot. In case you guys don't know. Undead can breathe underwater. Because, uh, believe it or not... 
Oh wait, no, it'll oh we don't breathe underwater. It lasts 300 percent longer. But it still drains. Weird. Did they change that in retail to actual underwater breathing, or has it always been just 300 percent longer? Huh. Can't say I noticed that. Or maybe I did. I'm just tired. <laughs> I've probably noticed that before in, in the past like 20 years of playing. All right, where are all the bleeding horrors at? Uh, for the ruined tower in southeast tears fall near Balnir Falls. It's gotta be down here, right? Oh, is that is that the tower up there? Hold on, let me look around here. Burial, Undercity. Plaguelands, Plaguelands. There ain't squat around here. I think it's this way. Oh, look, there's another person here. Here for you, look, it's the mage with the little homunculus. It's that hot gnome mage. I saw her like two hours ago. She's probably on Twitch. She's probably streaming right now. Oh lord, this guy. This guy's got a lot of health. Oh my lord. Jeez, dude, I got a pop evasion. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, wow. Jeez, I just got better pets. What the frack was that? My goodness. I gotta be careful around here. Dang, is everyone level 10? Oh man, oh no. These guys might be too tough. There's the homunculus girl. <laughs> Ganks. <laughs> Gangs, gangs, stabish. No, gang, gangsta bish. <laughs> Has invited you to join the gangsta crew. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I almost said accept. <laughs> no, I'm not joining the gangsta crew. <laughs> He's the first member of. The gangsta crew. Um, where's the ruined tower? There it is, right? Isn't that it? I want to see how high level the uh, Scarlet people are. Let's see if I can take the spirit. Not 
cursed. Screw you. Oh my gosh! Oh, oh my lord! <laughs> I love that guy. <laughs> yeah, these guys are really tough. Although one more kill and I'm uh, level 10. Crusader Outpost, okay. What, what are the guys around here looking like? Level 9? Scarlet. I need to kill five Scarlet Friars and then the Captain. Oh yeah, this looks better. This looks better. Level 9, I think it can handle. Thank God for Shadow Strike. Yeah, let's try and do let's try and do this quest because I'll be ten, and I think I'll I'll work to town after that. Ding! Level ten, baby. Where's my achievement? Uh oh. Here for you. I didn't mean to like steal that one kill. <laughs> Sorry. Dang, priest is like. Is Shadow Priest broken? Oh, snap. I got invited! Oh man, this is gonna make it so much quicker. Uh oh. Hold on, girl. I'm pulling everything, hold on! I'm not strong enough for this. Quest complete, Captain Vashon. Dang. Shadow Priest broken. I can't carry any more of those. I want to stick around, but I'm so tired. It's okay, we're almost done. I'm just gonna finish this quest and head back to town. Oh look, this guy's in that guild first of the month. <laughs> is there one more friar around here? Yes, there is. Too far away. Gonna head to bed. Alright, well. Like I said. I'll be I'll be ch I'll be clocking out in a few as well. But thanks for ha hanging out, uh, Carol. Always a pleasure. I hope that was some good uh, background noise for you. I can't carry any more of those. Dang, this guy's still killing people. Okay, that's cool. Okay, let's warp, uh, yeah, let's warp back to town. Oh, whoa, whoa, hold on, look at this chest I just got. Nice. Big upgrade. I can't use that. It's not ready yet. That guy's got that drip, look at me. I got that sailor cosplay going. Okay, let us turn... Oh, we can't... Oh, oh, snap! I forgot I have talents! Oh, man, I forgot I got talents! Dude. Oh, I'm gonna have to decide. You know what? I might have to read which ones are fun slash good in Classic slash uh, Season of Discovery. 
So subtlety, increased damage you dealt a deal from from behind. Reduces the chance of being detected in stealth, combat, dodge, sinister strike, gouge, assassination, eviscerate. After killing an opponent that yields honor, you gain a 20% increased crit chance on your next attack. Increase your crit chance. Yeah. I'm gonna have to look at this guy's name. Got a Zug. Zug Zug. Um, I'm, I'm gonna have to look that up. I have no idea what spec is gonna be. I don't really care about, like, uh, like the meta. <laughs> you know? I don't care which one's, like, the best or not, but I just I don't want to pick like the terrible one. Uh, Zygan in Brill wants you to assassinate Captain Melrache and his two bodyguards. In Northern Tirisval, past Fowl's Rest. Okay, so Northern Tirisval, somewhere up here maybe? Fowl's Rest. Hmm, I'm not sure where that is. Let me let me sell some crap. And you are sell that. 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 And let me just make these real quick. I'm gonna have to level up my first aid. I think you need to get to 40. There's a lot of people milling about, though. Look, it's Marge again. <laughs> Speak quickly. Speak quickly, outsider. Yeah, I need to be 40 to make uh, nicer bandages. Oh, you know what? Let me check my trainer, too. I've probably got new moves. What is it? Ooh, new new quest too. Go talk to a guy in the city. That's probably a good idea. Ooh, slice and dice. Finishing move that increases melee attack speed. That's a cool one. That's a cool one. Sprint. Oh, dude, this is oh, sprint is so good. Increases movement speed by fifty percent for fifteen seconds. Doesn't break stealth. Victory for Sylvanas. That's so good. I love sprint. Rogues are just so mobile. We go mobile. I'm gonna put it over here too. I'm gonna put it in stealth too because it doesn't break stealth. I am forsaken. Oh, dual wielding. Oh man, dude, everything is coming together. Sap. Capacity. Oh man, dude! Literally everything is coming together now that I'm ten. Sap is so good. Like I can kill more than one guy at once now. Stink and sap someone. Okay, so let's put sap on my hot bar. That's really good. And what else is there? Dual wield. So now I can get another dagger. And I should be doing way more damage. Assassination. So that's... Slice and dice is really... You don't need to do slice and dice all the time. But you want to do this at least once. So you're getting that faster attack speed. Evasion gouge. Yeah, that's sick. I wonder if I can buy... Let me just look real quick. Let me uh, sprint down. Look how stinking fast I am. Leather armor. Apprentice armor. Weaponsmith. There we go. Can I buy like a cheap dagger? Yes, I can. Heck yeah. Let's go. Oh, bro. Let's go. Two daggers. Three to seven, two to four. Should I just get two stilettos? Let's do it. I think I got two! Oh, that's so annoying. My mouse is double clicking every time I click. That's why I just think I bought two. So that's annoying. 
just wasted some copper. Um, look at that too. Nice, dual wielding, we got way more moves. I still don't know how to get any more runes though. Victory for Sylvanas. I don't want to look up anything, but I might have to do some research and be like, am I doing Season of Discovery right? Or is like, listening. have I missed the way to get all the cool new moves? <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. But hey, level 10. Tons of new stuff. I'm excited. It's like really good moves we just got. Way more damage. Way more utility. Good stuff. Oh, you know what? No, no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna log out down here like a pleb. There we go. That's good. 